Hello and welcome back to Crazy Hank TV. Today we're going to ask the question, is The West Wing one of the greatest shows in television history? Now to be considered a great show, I would think you have to have great writing, great directing, great storylines, great characters, great actors, and the list goes on and on to be considered a great show. Now let's look at some of the stuff from The West Wing. Let's look at the writing. Now you start with Aaron Sorkin, who was a creator and head writer for the first four years. I think we got to check great there. I mean, it was just fantastic. Now, a lot of people will tell you after the fourth season, it dropped off that because we lost Rob Lowe, Sam Seaborn, and we lost Aaron Sorkin, left the, left the show. Now, I'm on the side saying, okay, it might not have been the best, but to me, it was still a great show. A lot of people say it's unwatchable. I'm not here to tell you you're wrong, you're right. We all have difference of opinion. We all have different tastes. For me, it still worked. Even season seven is probably one of my favorite seasons of The West Wing. I enjoyed that whole storyline, the election and the campaigning, all the behind the scenes stuff that goes on in an election and politics. I enjoyed that. So I'm going to say, yes, The West Wing had great writing. Um, as far as characters, it had fantastic characters. Now, there was a character in season one I didn't like. And they got rid of her. And I'm not blaming the actress. They had nothing to do with the actress. It's just the way they told her story, the way they portrayed her. Uh, it was Mandy. And I know I'm not alone on this. I know a lot of people don't like her. But some people do. If you do like her and you and you thought she got a raw deal, put it in the comments section. Say, you're crazy. She was a great character. But I lost interest in her in the pilot episode when she drives up the sidewalk to talk to the congressman or senator, whoever whoever it was. I just felt that was a little over the top, and I felt her character was a little over the top. I just didn't, I didn't just didn't care for her. But if you ask people about the West Wing, who's your favorite character? A lot of people will say Josh, but there's so many to choose from. You have CJ, you have Charlie, you have the president, you have you have um, Sam Seaborn, you have Donna, you have so many different characters. You have Toby, you have Mrs. Bartlett. I mean, the, it, the list really goes, it's one of those things. It just goes on and on and on. Now, all those characters I love. Now, Toby, would I hang out with Toby? I don't know. I, I don't know if I could hang out with Toby. Maybe if he's drinking, he's a little less, you know, you know uptight. But just kidding. I mean, he's but a fantastic character. And, and some of the characters they brought in, like Ainsley Hayes, I love her character. She was funny. It was great that she was a Republican and a Democratic uh Wing, West Wing was Democratic, and she, they brought her in as a Republican just because she was smart and all that stuff. I enjoyed that, and some of the funnier scenes in the show were from that. Um, again, there's so many different scenes you go, oh my God. So there you go, characters. Now, actors, that fantastic. I mean, the fantastic ensemble cast. Just an amazing, amazing, and, and they kept their egos at check for the most part. I mean, you just, one of those things where the, it was the product. It was, we're going to do this for the fans and just a fantastic job. So I'm going to say the West Wing is one of the greatest shows of all time. Again, I, even the theme song, I, when I'm watching the show over and over again, like most of us do, we rewatch shows that are great shows. And I've seen the West Wing probably four or five times all the way through. And then I just pick up different episodes. I like, and I'll watch them again. And that's another sign of a great show is we'll watch it over and over and over again. So yeah, West Wing, one of the greatest shows of all time in television history. I would love to see a spinoff of Sam Seaborn as the president or someone else. Anyway, I, I think it's time that we could, we and they could probably juice it up a little, make it a little more edgier than it was back then or today's standards. But there we go. Do you agree with me? Disagree with me? Put it in the comment section. The West Wing, I say it's a great show. One of the greatest of all times. What say you? We'll be back later on. I'm out. Bye, everybody.